da 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 G'day legends, TJC Sports here, welcome back to another NRL live stream reaction, welcome back to our second game of the day, it is the Cronulla Sharks versus the Canberra Raiders here, Cronulla Sharks obviously hosting here, both teams coming off some games, let's take a look at exactly how the uh, results actually went last week for them, Cronulla Sharkies lost to the West Tigers, I think everybody will remember that, the 32-6, very memorable game, absolutely loved that stream, can the Sharkies bounce back today? That's the real question. And again, we can all last week and view it as, oh, the Tigers got lucky, or will they actually wake up and do something more against the Canberra, I mean, against the Canberra Raiders, who lost by eight to the New Zealand Warriors on the Friday game. The New Zealand Warriors and, you know, who won the last game, actually, you know, today, are a decent side. So I'm not going to hold that against the Raiders, but, like, Honestly, if we were going off last week's performances, you probably would go with Raiders, right, Legends? But ultimately, there is the argument to be had. Maybe they were just starting well, Legends. Um, I don't know, though. You know, maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, Legends. Who knows? It really is just down to opinion, if we're being straight up honest with ourselves, guys. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoy. Just remember, this is only on KO, so I'm just quickly streaming KO here. By the way, apologies if you hear anything in the background. Um, there's a there's a little uh, bit of cooking going on in the uh, background, so that's uh, what you're going to be hearing. Okay, the sizzling. The, it's annoying to me, but you know what I mean? It's uh, a little out of my control, guys. As we carry on here. Look, it's still... Oh, well, that confused me a little. The stream thing at the green dot still, but it said unknown. But, yeah, it's good now. We're good with our connection. Sweet. It was probably just confused because I was streaming, guys. Guess who's back, back, back again, again. It's Bunny's Guy 21. How you going, my bro? Welcome to the stream. We're not supporting your green team today. We're supporting the green machine, the Canberra Raiders, who I will be watching live next week when they take on my Parramatta Eels. Last time I streamed them before, I know the result, Legends. I am ready. Are you ready? Because I am. Sharks by five. First try scorer, Will Kennedy. Will Kennedy's going to go over, guys. The fullback. He may be Lord Voldemort, but he can score tries. Give that to him. Unlike the bad hair day, Dylan Edwards, he decides to have no hair and turn into the man to end Harry Potter's life. Obviously, tomorrow, guys, Power and Tigers, that's the only game that will be left after this one, and that will not be streamed, as I will be vlogging, boys and girls. Aussie Bloke Craig says, first try scorer, a big grey shark swimming over the line. A big grey shark and a run over, man. It doesn't matter what shark. A big grey shark in general is just going to smack over. He don't care. He's going to smack a dak, dak, dak. How? Boom. Get out the boxing gloves and the narrations. The time is now here, legends. The time for the to for the Tigers, the Eels. G'day, legends, says Liam. It's an NBA pro. It's bait. G'day, bro. G'day, g'day, g'day. Speaking of which, earlier, time to get on with the team list, guys. For the team list, we have Will Kennedy at fullback. Lord Voldemort once again for the fullback position with Sion Nikotoa and Renata Mulatalo on the wings for Sharkies, guys. Jesse Ramian and KL Iro or Iro or whatever in the centers. Braden Trindle and Nicholas Hines in the halves. Tom Hazelton and Oregon Kafusi at the props. Blake Braley at nine. Talakai and Wilton in the second row. And that lock, the captain himself, Cameron McInnes. The interchange is Daniel Atkinson, Jack Williams, Billy Burns, and Tuku uh, Tapua. Jaden Barrell manages to bag that 18th man spot. A bit of a classic in the New South Wales Cup there for the Cronulla Sharkies there with Jaden Barrell getting there. For the Canberra Raiders, on the other hand, the visiting side today, we have Jordan Rapana running upon us with the fullback position. James Schiller and Xavier Savage on the wings. Obviously, Nick Kodrick not there. Matt Tomoko and Sebastian Chris in the centres. 
Eepin Strange and Jamal Fogarty in the half. Eepin Strange, man, for Raiders. Don't feel right. Josh Papaliti and Joseph Tarpany in the props. Danny Levi at nine. Hudson Young and Zach Hosking in the second row because obviously Zach Hosking coming in for the out Elliot Whitehead. Morgan Smithies is the lock. And the interchange is Tom Sterling, Sterling, Starling, um, Atta Mariota, Pasami Solo, and Corey Horsburgh. Nick Kotrick gets 18th man position. So good on James Schiller winning his spot into the team. Can Mr. Schiller keep it up? Or will there be a late change? I think it's a little late for a late change, but still. Who knows? Maybe we'll get a little bit of a late change. Maybe we'll get a late try. Maybe this will be a thrilling match, guys. Maybe we'll have an absolute shocker in this one. Maybe it'll be a smashing. It could be anything, as some creators would say. It could be anything, Legends. In this, in the last two games these teams have played, both have won. But I would like to point out when the Sharkies won, it was an absolute smashing at 24-6. to six. And speaking of 24s, that's how much Raiders won the next, the previous game. The previous game before that in the same year, it was Sharks 20, Raiders 24. So it's one of these games where either Cronulla will run with it or it'll be really close in my opinion. Close win to Raiders or Cronulla run. That's how the only two ways I think this game will go. If Raiders run away with it, good on them. It scares me for next week. But I'm going with it to be one of the other two I said here. I love Go Para, mate. Liam Pritchard, I appreciate you, bro. Go Para, Liam, mate. Absolutely. I'll see you at the footy tomorrow, mate. I'll see you there too, Liam, mate. I'm over the moon for it. I'm excited, bro. We're going to get it done. We're going to get it started. You and I, Liam, and everyone else, we're going to show them exactly what it means when you take out inconsistency and you replace it for weakness. Mate, it's a grave mistake. Mistake. Come tomorrow, ga tomorrow's game. They're going to pay with their two points. We're going to win it, Legends. Paramount tomorrow. Liam, I'll see you there, buddy. G'day, g'day, g'day. Mel in the chat says, White Eels and Raiders all in the top eight. Whoop, whoop. Hey, I'll join that, Mel. Come on, Mel, together. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. All three of the best in the top eight. Whoop, whoop. Celebrate, Legends. Celebrate good times. Come on. It's time to celebrate, Legends. It's time to celebrate hard, actually, about this game. Currently, we are about three minutes away from the game kicking off at this point in time, uh, Legends. Um, the Cronulla Sharks at $1.67 to win. Raiders at $2.22. Clearly, the Sharkies are favourites. And I think the Sharkies should be favourites. But don't put it past the Canberra Raiders to do something in this one. I think if there's a team that's going to do it based on their form right now, it's going to be Canberra Raiders. Canberra Raiders, Legends, they're a team I did not rate at all heading into this season. You can just look at my ladder prediction to see that, but I do have a strange feeling. What's up? Sorry about the swearing. All good, Liam Porter, mate. We all get frustrated with our team sometimes, so it's all good, um, um, Liam. Mate, I understand Liam Porter, but um, bro, we're focusing on this game now, and you can always win next week, Liam, mate. Luke Brooks, the GOAT, going to get it done. Who has the bye next week? Who's the unfortunate sap? that doesn't get to watch their team. Let's see. Who's it going to be? It's going to be the Sharkies. Speak of the Devils playing today. Sharkies, they get their bye next week. They won't be playing, guys. Massive. Um, Mel says, oh, oh, the Finns. Oh, and the Finns. Yes. Oh, and the Finns. Yes, Mel. Oh, oh, and the Finns. Oh, and the Finns. G'day. G'day, g'day, um, uh, Dean Love stuff. G'day, mate. Um, can you watch my edit? I can watch you edit half time legend. Um, I've got to focus on the half an hour. But if you stick around through the stream and all that, um, yeah, yeah, second up, so definitely half time. I'll check out your um, edit, bro. But I've also probably got to watch it on mute because of the fact that I've got, um, yeah, because because I've got to be careful with copyright, with music and stuff. But Jordan Rapida, two hundred. Is that two hundred games? Jordan Rapida, career milestone for him there, legends. Almost at the start of this game here, but one hundred percent, I'll watch it then, bro. 31 votes on the poll as Cronulla Sharks run out onto the field here. I'll be honest, I do not think Shark Park's that great of a place. I'll be honest, probably the worst stadium that I've travelled to, but maybe I just haven't travelled to enough. I haven't been to a few places. I haven't been to Belmore yet. I haven't been to, I haven't been to any of the Tigers' old places that I'm a fan of them keeping. Glad you enjoyed your gelato, Dean Love stuff. Jason Reader says Sharks 1 to 12. Yeah, I'm going Sharkies in this one too, man. But I've got a strange feeling we could be surprised. i got a strange feeling this is going to be like that 24-12 to 12 scenario, guys. 
Cronulla Sharks or Raiders? Will the hunt be on or will the Sharks catch him in the deep seas? KL Iro here with the determination. He's been fighting for that spot for a while and now he's finally going to get it. He wants the game to begin. Nico Hines looking up to the sky. He knows how important this is for their side. After a loss to the Tigers, they'll be needing this. They'll be hungry for it. Speaking of hungry for it, here they go. Can the Raiders tame the beast that is the Sharks? Or will the Sharks gobble them up whole? Jock Papali'i trying to answer that question by absolutely smashing into them. I hate the animal, the shark. May it, sharks terrify me, to be honest with you, Legend. Part of the reason I don't I don't go to um, deep beaches often where they don't often check. But um, just a personal thing of mine. Back over. Gets it short. Hudson Young now. Hudson Young. Hudson Young. We're underway with the spin held down. Talakai shifts into the second row now. Do we have a late change to the lineups, actually? Do we have a late change to the lineups? Gee, Bunny's guy pointed out. We might have a late change that changed from the... Yep, Talakai's gone to the second row, guys. And go... Obviously, mate. Looking pretty good. It's um, You know what? Talakai in second row. He's got the body for it, you know? My arm goes for sharks, but it, but, I, but he's scared of them. Mate, they're terrifying sharky, sharks, but, you know, good on her, you know? Um, credit to you if you support the Cronulla Sharks. I just... I wouldn't. I, I would never be a Sharks supporter, but, you know, I think there's a reason that they don't have any uh, bloggers, the Cronulla Sharks, but maybe that'll change. If you're a Cronulla Shark person and you want to be a creator, get Sharky vlogs out because nobody really does, bro. It'll be your chance. Ow. Back over. Hazleton. Hazleton with the potential gap here with a nip. Matt Patty back. Give him a hit. The Raiders, 30. They're going back on side here. Under 50 metres gain. Cronulla Sharks with the brutally high kick. Oh, with Mulatalo taken out there. Oh, it might not matter if Iro can get there. And no, they managed to get the Raiders into a forceful position. Kyle Iro was shouting, going, what, sir? The Raiders win a penalty despite what the Cronulla Sharks wanted. The Canberra Raiders get it. Toby ruled off watching in the box, a little confused by what happened, I think. What happened is it went in the air. It, collect, it was collected by Strange, and let's see this. Yep. Okay, what? Well, are they going to say take it without the ball? Okay, all right. Now it's going to be, yeah, pushing the defender. I had a feeling if they were going to give anything, that would be it for them. I was a little confused at first, but there you have it. They only kill five people a year. I know they don't hurt many people, Legend, but it's still not a, um, it's still not a thing where I exactly want to be swimming with them, Legend. It's exactly a thing where I want to be swimming with them. I'm not going to say I'm going to live my life in fear. I could easily go into the waters, but, like, you know, I won't be, um, you won't see me calling the Sharks anywhere near my favourite thing of what the uh, names of each club, um, you know, represents. Jordan Rapina, just like a shark, they deep, they lurk in the seas, and they bite when they get the chance. That's what the Canela Sharkies love to do. Canberra Raiders, Danny Levi, short to Joseph Tarpany, the former Newcastle Knights. Knights losing to Warriors um, in the last game. New Zealand, yeah, look, they gave Knights a good shot, but in the end, they just weren't quite as good. I wouldn't say I love it, bro, but, um, you know, I I don't think I hate it, you know. I definitely don't hate it, Legend. Uh, Will Kennedy and, oh, knock on. Cronulla Sharks, dearie me. Messing it up, dropping all the bags. Dropping every possible one they could. Hooks for hands. Terrible. And now the Raiders will get a chance right in front here. The Canberra Raiders legends to put us in here. The Canberra Raiders to bag us the first try of the game, legends. I'm more scared of jellyfish than the Sharks. I don't know, man. I'm not very... I don't know. I think I could outdo a jellyfish. <laughs> Honestly, I think it's just the look, too. Just not a fan of them. Jamal Fogarty now. Fogarty feeds him. Back over to the right here with Matt Tomoko. To Smoko. To Smoko fending the ball off. Matt to Smoko held down. Wouldn't say I'm scared though. I just also say I stay away from them, bro. I I ain't if, if you haven't checked those waters, I ain't risking it. I'm not risking being one of those five. We're the kind of family that I'm from where we'll be one of those five people if we're not careful. Josh Barbaliti. And now it's a six again for the Canberra Raiders. There you have it, legends. Now over to the left. Danny Levi back to... Oh, no. Hudson Young, who shows himself. 
with an error there. Shows the Raiders exactly what not to do. Great demonstration. Now don't do it again, Hudson Young. Ridiculous, bro. And they challenge. Boo, Raiders is Harley were banned. I wonder who you go for, Harley, mate. I know you go for the Sharkies. Just kidding, Harley. Very passionate Sharky supporter, aren't you? Well, don't blame you. Go boo, bro. Boo! <laughs> My teacher picks Fogarty says. Well, does a little Dean love stuff. Does a little Dean love stuff. But Jamal Fogarty is a is a great halfback for the uh, Raiders. And he's a player that the Titans really should have kept. Speaking of should have kept, you should have kept hold of that ball, Talakai. Canberra Raiders now with the ball. Tackle zero. Raiders momentum. Over to Joseph Tarpany. Tackle zero. Go, Joseph Tarpany. Joseph Tarpany out down now. Code snails, box jelly, bridge balloon, blah, 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 blah. All great reasons to stay out of the water in Australia. Sharks, sea, sea sharks, snowfish. All great reasons to stay out of the water in Australia. <laughs> you just got to be wary, in my opinion, legend. Hudson Young. Ethan Strange. Ethan Strange for the line. Oh, not very strange there, though, as he gets stopped by Nico Hines. Then running straight at them is the Raiders number four, Sebastian Chris. Joseph Tarpany now. They're halfway through the set. Tarpany, a player I highly rate. Is that a knock on there against Danny Levi there? Yes, the referee agrees. Danny Levi, unfortunately, you've just muppeted it up. You've muppeted it up, bro. You've done a muppet move and now you've mistaken it. I said Jamal Fogarty in class and I got sent out of class. <laughs> misheard you, legend, didn't they? They misheard you when you said Jamal Fogarty. Jeez. I feel for your buddies, guy, but uh, that's school for you. That's cool for ya. Oh, but G, but he's got 21. Feel for ya. Joseph Tarpany is frustrated there. You can see it on his face about that one. Alright, 5, 4. Hurry up with the scrum legends. And there. Ronaldo Muladalo now. Sioni Katoa. Sioni Katoa. And he stopped. Now over to the left. Back to Cameron McInnes. Cameron McInnes, guys, the lock and number nine. He played both positions in his career. And now he knocks the ball off. He wants... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. What was that? Run, TJ, so you're going to score, mate. I would score in this one with errors like that. Ridiculous. Cameron... McKinnis mucking it all up, legends. And now Raiders get another chance. Oh, my God. Of course they did. Of course they did. Buddy's gone. They misheard you completely, didn't they? Completely. Now Daddy Levi. Back to Matt to, to, to Moko. Back to Moko. 33% completion rate for Sharky so far. You can say it's been less than ideal for the first 10 minutes for them. Fogarty then. Back to Morgan Smithies. Up with the Smithies. I feel like a Smithies. Josh Papali. Back. Fogarty. Strange. The half link it up for Sebastian Chris. And Sebastian Chris. Blake Braley, the last line of defense, stops him. Danny Levi then to Josh Papali. And Morgan Smithies knocks the ball on. Are you having a fantasy? <laughs> oh. I see cool. Cool Boots says, up the Sharks. You going for Sharkies, bro, mate? Well, I tip Sharks too, so I guess up the Sharks. But Canberra Raiders, legend. I always think they have a shot at these kind of games, and they muck it up there. Jeez. Tight contest was something where it was really tough for the Raiders last year. They only really won 1-12. to They never won 13+. plus. So, until their first game of this season, where they managed to get back to it. Isn't that a funny pattern, guys? Fourth minute, Sharks error. Fifth minute, Raiders error. Sixth minute, Sharks error. Seventh minute, Raiders area. A eighth minute, it's error, error, error back and forth, legends. It's error, error, error. It's like, here's an error, you take an error, you take an error, you'll take an error. It's like swapping things, borrowing legends. They're borrowing the mistake each time. Yeah, I just, mate, yeah, I just jinxed Mr. Smithers, bro. I just jinxed him. I feel so bad. How could, how dare I? How dare I jinx Mr. Smithers, mate? I feel so bad that I jinx Smithers. I love Smithers, brah. I don't want to jinx him. Blake Braley, 50 second meters gained. And the Canberra Raiders managed to collect here. 
Honestly, it just feels good being Easter, doesn't it, guys? Half an hour still to go in the first half here. Smithers, Mr. Burns assisted on the Simpsons. Yes, bro, exactly. Smithers, guys. Waylon Smithers, as he's called on the show. Ethan Strange now. Back over Schiller. Looking to get through. I always said Adam Jelliot, but I was like, hang on. Adam Jelliot plays for the uh, Newcastle Knights. That can't be right. That can't be right. When I was speaking at First Legends, right? I can't be right. I can't be thinking that straight. Camera Raiders. They managed to get to the halfway bit before Jamal Fogarty will just have to clear it here. Jamal will be relieved he jumped to the Raiders. Will Kennedy now. Lord Voldemort, what can you do, man? But cast Expelliarmus on the Raiders' defence. Now back over. Cronulla Sharks, Sharkies boys, they're looking to take a bite. Can they take a bite out of their meal, the Raider? I don't know about that, guys. You see, Vikings, they're pretty tough people to take down. I think they could take a Shark, a team of Raiders. Blake Braley. It depends, actually, though. If they were swimming in the middle of the ocean, yeah, nah. But, like, you know, on, like, some kind of shallow water, you know, that where this would probably be this kind of fight. I, I'm just thinking of this hypothetical legends. <laughs> I'm just thinking of this like hypothetically, like for fun. All right, Canberra Raiders keeping sharks out. Blake Braley down to Nico Hines. Nico Hines kicks high head to think that he was once a manly uh, junior and a Melbourne Storm player. I believe he had a close stint with the Broncos almost as well. So quite a bit for Nico. Back to Sebastian Chris. Sebastian Chris now being held around there. Then over to the left. Gets it to Ethan Strange. Back Xavier Savage. Xavier Savage here. Now back Hudson Young. Young looking to push up there. Blake Braley reading it well. Blake Braley's having a good defense. Oh! Good defensive game. I'm jinxing him. Xavier Savage with the sprint. On the 40. Fogarty. They're going to run it. They're going to run it. Zach Hosking. Back to Fogarty. Back over. And now they're going to keep running. Oh, my goodness. What a try. What a try. And I believe that was James Schiller that goes over. I still remember the exceptional try this boy scored versus the Storm. And now he's got that on his record. James Schiller, ladies and gentlemen, going, if you dare question why he was picked over Nick Kotrick, he'll show you there. Brilliant from him. Mr. James Schiller cutting up the competition. Zach Hosking, though, great pass there. Fogarty, oh, there was a bit of a flukiness to it, but now they're in the lead 4-0. How good is that? Canberra Raiders legends. And the Cronulla Sharkies will be left in disarray at the chance that they, go, oh, that they lose two games now, guys. Oh, oh, oh. Matt to Smoko with the great pass. And Voldemort couldn't get him. Mr. Kennedy, his tackle just wasn't meant to be. And the try, the singular Raider in front of all those Sharks I can see in the crowd cheering loud and proud in front of Schiller. I'm sure the Raiders drummer's there somewhere too. Plenty going on. In 11 games, he's got five tries. Not the best try, um, try record around that I've seen, but certainly a player where if you need someone to play that wing position, he can do it well for you. Happy Easter, James Schiller, and happy Easter to Raiders supporters. All right, Jamal Fogarty here, guys. He's looking up at the skies going, oh, man. Come on, do it for the green guys. All he can see is green guys. Jamal Fogarty with the kick. And he's got it. 6-0. The Canberra Raiders are on fire. The Raiders showing that they are no longer the faders right now. But that is subject to change, guys. That is subject to change, I swear, in this one. There could be a difference coming up soon, for all we know at this point in time here. Matt Tomoko jumping all over him. Obviously, guys, James Shearer, a player we went into the game going, oh, he can do something, but not that level. Cool boys, I used to use but... Yeah, yeah, religion playing legend. All right, 
And Raiders have scored first in eight of the past nine games against Sharks. That's a massive stat there, which actually leans in favour of the Sharks. The Sharks have won majority of those, I believe. So we'll see. But look, 6-0, I haven't decided who's won. I think Raiders have the advantage, but history and stats also go towards Sharkies in this one. So we'll see. All right, Hudson Young, the 11. Now to Joseph Tarpany. Tarpany, lock, prop, it don't matter. This man does a job. And he's a player that certainly would have done a great time if he was at the Newcastle Knights. And then Jordan Rappiner with a spin gets tackled. Danny Levi just passes short. And now the Raiders clear it. Will Kennedy's going to be allowed to go all the way 35 metres away from his own try line. Way too many metres there being allowed for him. The Canberra Raiders need to switch on in the defence. Could that be considered an obstruction there? Probably not, because Nico Hines just pats him away. He's not actually really running into the line, so fair enough. And then now Jesse Ramian. Jesse Ramian, he trips over, but he manages to push himself far enough. Now they're over the halfway line. Blake Braley forces a six again. Ruckin Fridge with an absolutely sprint through the line to the 40. The Canberra Raiders are all over the place in the defense as the Cronulla Sharkies take advantage. Cameron McInnes short over to Thomas Hazleton. And it's another six again, Ruckin Fridgeman. The Raiders can't put themselves back in it, guys. They keep interfering in that dang ruck. Nico Hines. Back to Trindle. Over and... Oh, Teague Wilson smashed there by Matt Tomoko with Jamal Fogarty. Braden Trindle. Harps linking up. Nico Hines. Then over to their number uh, 10, Oregon Kafusi. Interesting uh, hair there, hairdo from Kafusi compared to the past. Fourth tackle now. Braley. Blake Braley to Nico Hines. To Will Kennedy. And oh no, the error. And Raiders collect. Cronulla Sharks legends. They had so much momentum and promise. But they mess it up in the depths there of their chances. Sebastian Chris now on the first tackle. Blake Braley's having a ripper for the Sharkies. I don't care what anyone says. I'm, mate, I've seen him everywhere so far. Braley, the under-talked about number nine, guys. I swear. Go Sharks, he says. Well, go Sharkies. Right now, it's go, go, go Raiders for the Canberra guys. Up. Will it be up the milk, or will the Sharkies go, forget your milk, I'm biting you whole. I'm eating your whole. I don't need a side of milk, man. Joseph Tarpany. Tarpany now, Braley saving the day with the meters by holding the leg of him. Now over to the right here. Daddy Levi. Back to Fogarty. Back to Jordan Rappiner. I still think Jordy Rappin is better on the on the wing, but fullback, you know, yes, he does it. He does it enough. Nick Contry. Back. Strange. Ethan Strange. Ethan Strange! Ethan Strange for the Lloyd! Oh! Back over now. Savage. It's only backwards except for that one, which was a knock-on from Sebastian Chris Legends. But no, the referee, he's making his call now. The referee's stepping in here. Little talk among the players about what exactly happened in that position. Ethan Strange, I like the way he took on the line there. He really did try to get past them. And if he was right in front, he would have gone over. Look at that there. And Oh, my goodness. Silly pass. Silly pass. But Sebastian Chris definitely mucks himself up a little. Who's, let's see, let's see who can most drop it the most. Damn, mate. Damn, 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 damn. You're wait, we've seen so many drops so far. 60% possession so far to the Raiders. Yes, Raiders get the ball back because of the Cronulla Sharkies. All right. Savage. Xavier Savage! They couldn't keep the tackle on him. The man's going to run it all. And no matter the effort from them, the hell go over. Do you want a side of milk with that? Xavier Savage! The Raiders fans go wild among the sea of blue. Are the specks of green? The spots themselves. The crowd looks sick with the little spots of Raider supporters. Little green smallpox bar. And brilliance. The Canberra Raiders savage, savagely goes over with no regard for the health of his opponent, the Shark. Brilliant work. T-R-Y, it's a try. They do it. Xavier Savage, ladies and gentlemen. The milk is far from expired. 10-0 now. 
Happy Sunday, everybody! Happy Sunday! My Sunday could be good if Raiders win, because I tipped Waz and Raiders. I tipped Waz and Raiders too, Jetson, so we could vote. Well, actually, no, I tipped Sharks. Damn it. Well, then yours, yours could be great, Jetson. Yours could be great. Not mine, but yours could be great, though, Jim. Have a great time with yours, bro. Yo, yo, yo. What did you do today? What did I do today? I celebrated Easter, bro. Celebrate Easter with my family. And after these streams, I'm going to celebrate Easter more. I'm going to celebrate Easter more, legend. Appreciate it even better. The only obligation is to do my streams for the channel. That's it, mate. Also, the Easter Bunny will not be joining us for uh, this stream. Unfortunately, uh, suffered some technical difficulties in terms of TJC needing some fuel. All right. I, tip I tipped Raiders as Dean Love stuff. Well, I tipped Sharky. So, so far, you're correct, legend. 12-0 to the Canberra Raiders now, guys. There you have it. 47 votes so far on the poll. Looking good. Looking good, Legends. I don't know. Nothing good. Nothing good, Jetson. Nothing good's going up. I tipped, bro. Now, at 12-0, Savage, guys. He'll be glad to have been able to drink all the milk in the... Did the buddy die? I wouldn't say the buddy died. Well... He's not in the best of condition. <laughs> Great commentary, says Grant Black. Appreciate it, Grant, mate. I do my best with what I can do. Now, the Canberra Raiders, guys. Josh Papali'i. They get to restart here. We're halfway through the first half, Legends. If you're enjoying so far, I am obli obligated to say make sure you hit that like button and sub, guys, if you are new around here and haven't done that kind of stuff yet. Really is appreciated on the channel now no he's got it over a basket pushing out chocolate eggs mate exactly he's pushing out the chocolate eggs you don't need to know what's happened to him he's just pushing he's, yeah he's getting the chocolate eggs bro that's all he's doing now morgan smithy's third tackle halfway through the set fogarty with the flick backwards guys gets it over to zach hosking zach hosking hogsking the ball and then it goes over to levi Fourth tackle here. They're only going to get themselves to around the halfway. Not really the best meters we could have expected out of them. And now it's going to be a clearance. 47 meters gained in this one. Fifth tackle. They go over to the far left where Will Kennedy manages to collect. Now Will Kennedy, guys, taking the ball. Will Kennedy with the sidestep here. Will Kennedy charging forward. Will Kennedy smash there. TJC is great, mate. You're great, dude. Love stuff. Appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it very much, actually. Now, Cronell Sharks. And, oh, Sioni Katoa with the flip there, guys. He looked to go for him, but he couldn't. Then Nico Hines over to Ramian with a little bit of a sidestep there. They're missing Brighton Decora a little in this one, but like, you know, at the end of the day, one second row forward should not make you if you're a brilliant team. Uh, Kale Iro now. By the way, I know that there's a correct pronunciation, but Kale Iro, but like, I'm just kind of trying to figure that one out. Oh. It is Iro? Yeah, but no, no but, some, but some people, some people say it's pronounced in Ireland a way that I don't, yeah. Leo Francis Riker says, TJC champ, I got all six games correct, got Cronulla for this game. You see the Sharkies coming back? Look, I'm not saying I don't see the Sharkies coming back, Legend, but uh, yeah, I am a little nervous. It's Raiders game so far, man. It's Raiders game so far, but they might get their chance here because Jordan Rapina did one of the worst knock-ons out of the field I've ever seen. No pressure on him. And now the Cronulla Sharks are on the 10-meter line, Legends. So here they come. Cameron McInnes in there. Joseph Tarpany and Levi holding him out here. He's a champ, mate. You're a champ. We should be good soon in just a moment. We should be good in a moment. All right, just... All right, cool. Sweet. We're back. We're back. And apparently the Raiders have scored a try, according to some people. So great. Sweet. Good to hear the Raiders. The Raiders bouncing back with one of their own. I'll wait and test that out, guys. Uh, to the five people of the 20 that have stuck around, good on ya. That's just something that happens sometimes when this stuff got happens, Legends. That's just what happens sometimes when you, um, yeah, you can't really control it. But we're back now, finally. Alright, here we go. Here we go, Legends. I still don't know why it did that. But, yep, yeah, guys, the Canberra Raiders have a try. Daddy Levi, 10 career, free this season. He is on fire this year for the Canberra Raiders, Legends. Apologies about the slow thing. Now we are back and we are rocking. 16-0. 
the camera rail. Is it better not do that again? I am Raiders try. Heck yeah, Grant Black, bro. I Am I a champ? Absolutely, you're a champ, Dean Love Stuff. That's what I meant, bro. And there you have it. Right through the smack -a bang bang middle. We have it. 18 to nil. Woo-hoo. And that is what we're talking about. Really wish they didn't score while I had my power problem, but still. We're on the top, mate. We're just going and climbing on back up. 15 minutes to go still in the first half. Plenty still to be excited about, guys, as we wait for the game to kick off again here in this one, Legends. So far, going really good. Currently on the poll, we got our 53 votes. Good on you, Legends. Cradell Sharks now. Kicking it. And we begin again. Is it going to be Josh Papali again so I keep repeating myself? No, it'll be James Schiller. Now passing off to Corey Horsborough. Corey Horsborough to the line. The big-headed Ranger. The Ranger taking the hit. We'll all rem all the Para fans will remember Corey Horsborough for putting the middle finger up at us when he got injured. Joseph Tarpany now. Back over to Levi. Daddy Levi with the short pass. He's looking to go down. He's had a ripper of a season, possibly his best season in a while for the Canberra Raiders. Joseph Tarpany then. Tarpany with the split there. Joseph Tarpany charging. Joseph Tarpany held out. Fourth tackle now. Come on, Jordan Rapido. It's all Jays. I swear every name in this team begins with J. The amount I'm saying the Jays. And then Jamal Fogarty takes the kick. See you again. Another J. And then Mr. Will Kennedy collects. Lord Voldemort getting it to Ronaldo Muladalo. Ronaldo Muladalo, a little invisible so far right now in this game. I haven't seen much from Muladalo. And it's another mistake. Muladalo's arguing it with his teammates. But the referee does not want to hear it. Another error. Captain's challenge coming up for Cronulla. They're desperate not to be conceding next again. They're absolutely desperate. The Cronulla Sharks legends with the Royal of Bolos right now. Knock on is what the ref ruled. I didn't see any loss of the ball. Yep, yeah, that lost the ball. Ronaldo Molotalo. Ronaldo Molotalo legends. He lost the ball. He lost the ball there. But it was hit out. It actually was hit out though. So we got to say that... Um, we got to say it wasn't him and he regathers possession because it never hits the ground, I guess, right? Legends, so it should be okay for them. Oh, the Cronulla Sharkies will be relieved with that one, that the captain's challenge works out for them. Tackle after attack are held. Yeah, but the tackle was held down too long, so there you have it. The tackle was also held down too long. Had to be it. Now it's going in their favour, the Cronulla Sharks, 18-0. If they don't score next, it's danger levels for them. Jesse Rabia now. Rabia down the right centre here. This is this is peak, bro. This is peak of the Easter uh, footy. T now back over Hazelton. Stopped, stopped in the line. Held the the Canberra Raiders holding down like a brick wall here against them. Karen McKinnis then. Karen McKinnis with the slide into the line, head first. Boom, 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 boom. Then Blake Braley goes to Nico Hines. Nico Hines for the line. Nico Hines now. Nico Hines stopped on the 10 meter. He offloads. It goes backwards to Braley. It only bounces sideways, so it is no knock on. Was he tackled? Yes, he was. Blake Braley's like, come on, man. Come on. And he has to play the ball. Now to the left. Nico Hines. Nico Hines gets it off. Back over to Blake. Now over to McInnes. Cameron McInnes for the line. Cameron McInnes held now. Thank God we're not coming last. Thank God you're not coming last, man. That's the place nobody wants to come. Then short to the number 15 for the Cronulla Sharkies. And the Canberra Raiders will hold him up in the goal legends here. The Canberra Raiders, what defense, what attack so far. They've come to play and the Cronulla Sharkies are just doing everything they can to try and keep a game in this. Cameron McInnes. McInnes pushing through, putting phone on ch charge. I'm off Raiders 20 plus TJC. All right, mate, 20 plus is coming up soon, mate. Oh, you jinxed the Viking King. Raider Trindle goes over for the Sharks. The comeback potentially on. There they have it. 4 to 18. Cronulla Sharks legends running at it. Ball. Take it back. Round the clock. Round the clock effort there. 4 18. 
game back on, swimming through the depths. They raise up, they rise up for a four-pointer. The time Triber was second last. Your second last in love stuff. Well, you know, the Titans have had the worst starts in the season so far of a team. So last place makes sense. But, you know, early days, man, don't get too confident. No team should get too confident, in my opinion. Comeback starts now, says Dean Love Stuff. Possibly, bro. Possibly. Leo Francis Royker will want that because he tips sharks just like me. So, is the comeback on, guys? We'll see. We've got a wave of the kick, though. 11 career tries, 5 at Shark Park. He seems to like the away games more with that record. Nico Hines now, guys. The post right in front. Can he get it? Yeah! Oh, my God. No. Oh, yes, he can. That was the most curly ball I've ever seen for so close to the net. And now he's got it. 6-18. Just need a couple more, Nico. Sticko, Nico, guys. Come on, Raiders. Come on, Sharkies. We're getting a lot of back and forth between the two in the chat about who they want to get this one done. Which one you guys want? Come on, let me know. Which one do you want? Do you want Raiders or Sharkies, Legends? We need a bit of consistency there. Sharkies or Raiders? Raider Trindle will be proud of that one, though. The Cronulla Sharks halves, the only reason that they're currently in the position they're at, guys. On the, the In the coaching box, we've got the Cronulla Sharks coach. He's going, oh, how do I fix this? How do I make this better than it is? I sense a season-defining game from my beloved Paris to, tomorrow. I see it too, Leo Francis Royka, the dis mate, choosing a lot on how are you goes. Canberra Raiders. Clearing it, and now we got it. 9 out of 12 completions for Sharks, 14 out of 17 for Raiders. Honestly, not that far off from each other, but the point is the Raiders have looked a lot better and done a lot more in theirs overall throughout the game. The Cronulla Sharks, if they can get something, a little bit of momentum off of that Raider Trindle try, maybe they can find something close to the same lengths of what the Raiders have had. Back over Blake Braley. It truly is game on if they get the next one. Will Kennedy now held down. Braley then. Braley over to McKinnis. McKinnis now. Cameron McKinnis, Legends. Cameron McKinnis probably should have usually been starting. Down for Nukin, obviously. Great player, but like, let's face it, McKinnis is the man for the next couple of years after for Nukin. For Nukin's at the end of it all. Okay, I don't hate because I don't dislike them, but I don't love them and I don't like them. They just feel nothing, bro. They're enough to love stuff. I feel that way a few times. It's like, I don't hate them, I don't like them. <laughs> They're a team. And you watch them. That's it. And oh, what a hit on Schiller. Schiller, guys, gets absolutely smacked. And the Sharkies end up with the ball here. Cameron McKinnis taking his time to get up. Absolutely brilliant. The Raiders mucking up a prime chance to gain some meters. Cameron McKinnis. And right in front, it is danger zone. Danger warning. Extreme weather torrential warnings. For the defense of them. I sense a try a brewing for the Sharkies. If the Raiders don't defend this well. I sense a try. Blake Braley. Over to Nico. Sticko Nico. Gets it. And oh. You're joking me. The number. For, oh. The number four for the Sharkies. But Kyle Iro messes it up. Kyle Iro knocks the ball on right after we were just going on about one from the Raiders. And the Green Machine will get the ball back. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough, Dean Love Stuff. Legends, that's all good, man. You know, you love your team. You love the Buddies, bro. The Buddies are a good team to love. They're a great team to love, man, for your side. Okay? Mate, no, no trouble there. Now, feeding in the scrub here. Tarpany is off, guys. Pasami Solo is on. They're giving Tarpany a little bit of a rest there. They're letting him fan the waves, guys. All right, Cronulla Sharks taking their time getting off. Just pulling Nico Hines out of the tackle so he doesn't give away anything, the number 15 there. The Canberra Raiders, guys, can they do something here? Levi, 
not to Smithies, but to Corey Hosborough, who knocks the ball on. How many knock-ons can you do in a game? How many knock-ons are possible before it's just purposeful at this point in time? The Ranger, it's it is bloodstream to knock the ball on. Madness. Did somebody put soap on their hands before the game? Did somebody give a spray? Did somebody just pour buckets of water on them? How is the ball slipping so much? Is there a visible ring that only touches the colour green? Now feeding Sharkies with the scrum. So many scrums and not God's legends. Down the right. And Will Kennedy pushing himself. Baltimore held. Now Little Brayley. Little Brayley the Sharky. Getting it over. Gets it back. Brayley's now just going to take the tackle. Yeah, great team to love, mate. McKinnis. Back. For the Sharks. Sharks held back in this one. Guys, Oregon Kafusi there looking to get there. Could not quite find his way over. Brayley back over to Sigus in Metallicai. Now Ramian. Oh, no, goodness me. It's a full six again, though. Second tackle here. Back to Trendle. Trendle to Hines. Don't need to rush it too much. But maybe they'll get a try here and may not need to rush. They just need to score. Iro and Molotalo leaking up. Ronaldo Molotalo. Sue. And Ronaldo Molotalo scores. For the Sharkies. They're back in the game. 10-18. Could they come back before the halftime siren? Game on. What a match we are we are watching before our very eyes, legends. Round blue. Round blue, grey, hazel. Whatever eyes you have, you can appreciate how incredible this game is. 10-18. No, you yo ho ho yo ho ho ho. Eight point difference could be six point difference if they get this kick. Cronulla Sharks, after being 18 nil down, have gone. We ain't losing. Viking King, you have jinxed your side, man. I swear, you have jinxed them, bro. You have jinxed them to the extreme, and now there's no, there's no stopping the Sharkies in the momentum they've got. The Sharkies will not stop it. Scored in 10 straight games at Shark Park now, guys. Mulatalo refuses to not score on the home surface. Come on, Sharks. How long before half time? Still four and a half minutes. There's time. There's time for the Sharks to do it, man. Random Dragons fan in the crowd spotted. Nico Hines, he has seven out of eight goals this season for an 88% kicking rate. And he gets this one. He'll just up it. Here you go, Nico. Nico, can you pick o the right kick here? Nico, the pickle. Oh! Off the post, but it still goes in. He'll be relieved by that one. The stress on the hearts of every Cronulla Sharky from here all the way down to Penrith. Madness ensues as the 18-0 lead gets blown right now by the Raiders. 12-18 the scoreline. Sharky Spence, start, start biting your nails. It was a close kick there. Extremely close. The fact that he converted it surprised me a little. Can you... Oh, mate, I'll stop saying water, legend. I'll stop... No, nah, I won't because it's Cronulla Sharks, bro. Water puns, mate. It's fun. Splash, splish, splash. They were scoring a try. Now, Trindle. Gets it over short here. Teague Wilton's going to take the hit here. The Cronulla Sharks, guys, start, they started, you know, they um, they started pretty poor. But the Canberra Raiders, they're the ones blowing the lead right now. Sharkies are just simply doing what Sharks do best. <coughs> Does this mean that the, the Raiders aren't a top eight team? Because remember, guys, we know the Sharks can't beat top eight teams. Which means clearly the West Tigers are going to finish top four. Because it's the Tigers, bro. Eating pickles, but my dad likes them. What do you like in your time? Mate, yeah, I'm not a pickle guy either. Usually I don't really, I don't like pickles. They're not my thing, bro. 
They're not my thing, Pickles. Ah! Oh, what are they doing? The Raiders with the awful defense! And Blake Braley goes over! The comeback is completed! What on earth were you doing, Raiders? What on earth were you doing? That is one of the worst defensive moves I have ever seen in Rugby League! The way you opened up! The way nobody was on the line! Where were you? We watch it again! It was the kick! They were all so slow, the bounce worked in the favour of Katoa. And then, it was collected by Braley for a stroll over, but what the heck? You should have done so much better than that. That is going to be one of the best half-time comebacks I have seen in a while. Braden. Oh, brilliant. Blake Braley, ladies and gentlemen. Blake Braley. Straley. Kerr Braley scores 16-18, surely 18-18 in a second. This is why we call it the greatest game of all, because literally anything could happen. The greatest game of all has added another piece of comeback history of the first half to its books. Blake Braley will be proud of himself there. 13 tries in 114 games. He doesn't score often, but when he does, it's wonderful legends. I knew he was having a ripper of a game. I said it, and now he's going to get his free from free today, Nico Hines, as they equalise. There you got it, legends. 18 all the scoreline. The Raiders have messed up an 18 nil lead officially. Crazy. Maisie, I have never seen a Raiders Sharks game in a while play to the level of this one. Now the Sharkies, the only question will be at the rate they're going, could they potentially take the lead? Is somebody going to go one pointer or go over in general? 18 all. I love Alex Johnston. Do you guys? Oh, Alex Johnston's great, bro. Alex Johnston's great. For me, though, it's going to be a little sad that he's going to overtake Ken Irvine, probably, but still. Now, held down here, Braley, over to the right, Kale Iro. Comeback starts now. I said to you, just like, yeah, mate, the comeback, it doesn't start now. The comeback is here. They're all square legend. The Raiders completely mucking it up. Nico Hines, back to Oregon Kafusi. Oregon Kafusi here. Mate, they're already on the halfway line on third tackle. The Sharkies have completely switched the game around here. Genius, I'm genius. Mate, we're all geniuses, bro. I think we all were calling it, bro. We're all geniuses, mate, in this chat. It's, but you, you are too, Dean, though. Now the Sharkies, Nico Hines, the pink man, the pink boots, Marcus, over to Trindle. And Brandon Trindle gets tipped over there. Flindle, Flindle defense there. Flimsy, bro, Flimsy. Cronulla Sharks now. High kick, over to the right. Sione Katoa and Will Kennedy and Jordan Rapina flops on the ground. I think I think that the Raiders will manage to keep it 18 all, to be honest with you, Legends. I don't think they'll do any better or any worse. I think it'll be 18 nil at halftime, Legends. 18-18. One minute to go, and it's a penalty for the Raiders, or is it a knock-on? Looks like a knock-on against the Raiders here. Oh, no, Legends. Right in front, Sticky Ricky. Sticky Ricky has no response. You can see his face is turning red looking at this game. They've blown an 18 nil lead once again. I'm going to say that, Legends, because this is ridiculous. Mel says, just binding physio session. Looks like I missed a good first half. Anyone's game at this point. Oh, 18 nil to 18 all. Brilliant. At first, it was very one-sided. But yeah, Mel, it was a great first half. Doesn't really matter, though. Hey, eh? all right? Your physio and all that comes first. I hope that it's um, you're feeling a little better with it, Mel. And hopefully, um, ho hopefully the physio... I don't know if you've done it yet, but because you're saying you're fighting it, I'm hoping the physio session goes well. But if it went well, great to hear that, too. Do care, Mel. All right, remember the dogs players thought that Tar Mill lost the ball. He did it. Yeah, I know, legend. Break Bray Braley. Back over to Trindle. To Nico Hines. Nico Hines. Nico Hines. Nico Hines held back here. Now back Trindle. Gets over to Talakai. And Talakai knocks the ball on. Oh, my gosh. Right as I thought that we could be seeing a lead at halftime. Talakai adverts my expectations and exceeds them for the wrong reasons. What a bounce to go against him there. The bounce of death, I say, as it remains 18 all. 
Five seconds to go, the feet of the scrub. They'll only have one tackle, I think, the Raiders in them. And then the game is done for the first half. Don't know about you, Legends, but I'll call this half a victory, guys. I'll call it a massive victory, gosh. Great to see you. Great seeing you, Dean. Finishing. Oh, you're finishing it, Mel. Well, I hope that it's um I hope that it's helping out at least a little and by the end of it you'll feel it be feeling uh, great, Mel. Hopefully. I'm crossing my fingers about it, alright? I wanna hear how amazing you are, Mel, after this, okay? Well, I know you're amazing, but still. But still, but still. I know you're amazing, but hold it in. And TJC, I knew Mel Mel always held the ball because I saw him scream. You saw it. Yeah, you saw bro, you saw it. And alright, legends, there you have it. We are at halftime here at the stadium. Shark Park Legends, the score 18 all. Time to enter the halftime show. The final one of the round is time for the TJC Sports Halftime Show. We have your host, none other than TJC Sports. We're all amazing, exactly. You're all amazing, Legends. 18 all. Pump, 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 putting it down the middle here. And there you have it. Wonderful, wonderful half time, guys, to be at. Honestly, I'm in a little bit of shock. I was preparing to talk about Raiders just running away with it and not having much to say about Sharks, but the Sharkies changed it, man. They changed the game. They changed the day game. They went completely from nothing to everything. Zero to hero. Get a cape on them. They're superhuman legends. Saving the day for them. Mate, hero heroes don't always wear capes and masks. That's what I say with how the Sharkies have done. The Raiders mucking it all up, collecting their waters and all that. You can see the shark, the way the Sharkies set up very different to the Raiders. What the heck? The Sharkies got the Zupa Dupas. The Sharkies got the Zupa Dupas, legends. The Zupa Dupas to help them out there. Maybe that can get them all hyped up and energetic for the next bit. I love halftime too, man. If you don't know how halftime works, Legends, essentially this is the chill part of the stream where we talk about the game. We, um, you know, we have a little bit of chat. You guys um, can feel free to ask questions about footy or about yourself and we can just kind of, yeah, get going. Of course, you know, obviously personal family things and stuff. Like, don't ask that. But, like, you know, like in general, it's just a chill part of the stream where I can fully have a conversation with you and not be mostly focusing on the game, you know? Um, legend. So yeah, it's a pretty okay time in the uh, stream from my um, own thought process at all. I love Zumba Doopers. Mate, then they should be handing you one. Get one over to Dean, love stuff. Why aren't you doing it, Cronulla? Why aren't you giving Dean one? Mate, Dean deserves one. Why isn't he being handed one on a platter? Just cruel. It's just cruel that they don't want to give you one, bro. It's not fair. You deserve you deserve the best, mate. You deserve it. You deserve to taste the wonderful Zupa Dupa. Jason Reader says anything can happen in the second half. Mate, after that comeback in the first half, I'm convinced that Martians could land on the field and say they want to invade just that stadium, make it their territory, and create a country out of Shark Park. That is more likely than... that. That, that, is, that is just as likely as the crazy stuff I saw in that half. Ridiculous legends, what I've seen. Zupa Dupas are the ice blocks we used to get at school. Haven't had one in years. Cola is the best life. There's plenty, bro. There's plenty to pick from, Ozzy Black Craig. I used to get Zoop. We, we all used to get them at school, didn't we? They're getting them in the sheds and having a fun time with them. <sighs> Honestly, I'm just ready. Happy Easter, Legends. We're on to the second half and final bit of the streams for this round very soon. Look, I'm really happy with that. Um, it shocked me a little. I was a little bit like, what was I watching when I saw it? That result just, what? What? How do you, especially with that last try, okay, credit to Sharkies for how they did, but that last try, what was that? What was that from from uh, Raiders in the defense on that final bit? That just, that made me want to face palm, guys. Like, I, you know, I like to be fair. I like to say, oh, you know, you know, what were they meant to do in that position? The other team was just brilliant. It was a great kick and it was an unlucky bounce. But my God, was that ridiculous the way the defense opened up there. You wouldn't see the Pampers defense opening up like that. That's like what I'm trying to say, Legends, with that when you say what were they meant to do. Pampers don't open up like that, you know? And I'm not trying to compare them to Pampers. I'm just, I'm saying, 
person. I'm just like saying, I'm not like trying to make it a, uh, oh, it has to be this way or that way. It's just, you know, the truth. It's just the truth. Uh, it's just the truth. It's helping my spine or don't. It's painful. Thank you. Who scored the tries, please? Well, the, the one to put it all level was uh, Blake Braley. We also had one from Mulatale and one from Trindle for the Sharkies. For the Raiders, it was James Schiller, um, Danny Levi, and Xavier Savage. They're the ones that scored for Raiders Legend to make it all square right now at this point in the uh, game. I hope that that's, uh, I hope that that's um, an all right uh, way of putting it for you. You know... All right, let's go. Happy Easter, me. Happy Easter, Dean. Love stuff, bro. Happy Easter, bro. Uh, happy Easter, who scored the tries. Yep, Fairy Floss is the best. I still have them at, bloody, oh, at school. Mate, you still have them at school. Of course you do, Dean. Love stuff, mate. You're a young bloke, of course. No problem, Mel. Hainsey says, you know the drill, dog. Of course I do. Hainsey, I'll see you there, mate. I know the drill 100%, legend. The dog will be back. Rugby League History says, Canberra choking. Mate, they're becoming the Canberra faders. I jinxed them. I said it 18, bro. When they scored 18 and it was nil, I went, nah, the Canberra Raiders, they're not being the faders anymore. And look what they've done. They've, they've, they've become more than the faders. They've become, they've become the fading chokers, bro. Ridiculous. That final try, I'm still getting over. I'm, I I still have not mentally processed that. Yeah, you're only 10 legend. Exactly. Of course you're still in school, bro. Who? Very few people aren't in school at 10. Okay, that live in places like Australia. Like, very few legend. I, I kind of, you know, it's pretty obvious you're in school, kid. Pretty obvious indeed, Aroni. Pretty, pretty, pretty obvious to myself, mate. If I'm being honest with you, straight up, bro. 66 votes so far, guys. Okay, I'm liking that at half time. That's wonderful. That's brilliant. I'm liking it. Um, we're going well so far compared to the last stream. Um, the last stream was good, but like this one's, yeah, we're, we got some great interaction. Yes, I'm baby. Yes, baby, bro. Yes, legend. I don't know how you guys eat this, have been, but for myself, it's been all right. I think the Easter buddies has seen better days. Uh, what do you think, legends? I think he's seen better days. Uh, uh, yeah. I think he's seen much better days than this. <laughs> much better days than that, guys. The Sharks players don't deserve to have Super Dupers, just us, mate. Yeah, let's get rid of it, bro. Get rid of the Sharky Super Dupers. Pass them over to us, Legends, okay? We'll steal them from them. The, the, why? Why do they get Super Dupers and we don't? Not fair, man. Unfair. It's, a, it's just not right. It's just not right. It's just not fair. It's just ridiculous. A joke, brah. An absolute joke, brah. Crazy. Crazy daisy paisy, guys. Easter buddy, what happened? Follow, follow, follow. We are the boys from the capital. Follow, 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 legends. We are the boys. We're going to do it, bro. Cronulla Sharks and the Raiders. The Raiders honestly look bummed, and I can't blame them. When you choke a lead that big, I'd be bummed too. I honestly do not have one positive thing to say about their defense in that that conceding, bro. 18 nil to 18 all. I've got no real defense, really. I did it. Can you stop saying sandwiches, chicken and. Hey, stop it, man. Stop it. Stop it, legend. Poor buddy. Yeah, poor buddy, legend. Yeah, no, no. Poor me. Poor me for not having. Put it, I'm not able to put him out of his misery because of the stream. <laughs> The buddy just, it had to happen, man. It had to happen, unfortunately, for the buddy's sake, bro. Um, if you like the Easter buddy, don't look at him right now. <laughs> don't, don't even, like, just pretend he doesn't exist right now, Legends. If I'm you, that's what I'm doing. Do, 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 do. If you enjoy like so, Dean is a vegetarian. You're, up, you're asserting him, bro. You're asserting the vegetarian, bro. Mel says, tip sharks, but want Raiders to win, lol. <laughs> Look, I I tipped the Sharks, but I don't know. You can tell me what you think, Legends. I don't know if I want to face the Radio Raiders off a loss or a win. I really do not know. As a Para supporter, when I'm travelling to Canberra for a week, I do want Para to win, but I don't know which one's better for them. A loss or a win taking on Raiders. Either way, I think we're going to get a game given to us, but I don't really know. 
which is better. I'm sure rugby league history or something would probably have an idea. Or probably doesn't even have a great feeling right about that. Vegetarians need to learn that their feelings are not important, more important than anyone else. Mate, exactly. Exactly. Right, they're not impor more important. We all equal legends. We are equal. We are equal. Well, actually, you know, as equal as we can be, you know, as equal as we can possibly be as a group and a community. Honestly, am I the only one that feels like when you have such an exceptional first half, half time feels like a chore to sit through just because you really want to see that momentum go up again and keep going, keep charging forward here? I, I That's kind of how I feel right now. I really want to see the second half and just how they go. I'm just not keen on Sharks, so right as it is. Yeah, I'm not that... Um, I'm not very keen on the... Um, Sharkies either. I think that they're one of the most dull groups out there, but, you know, credit to anybody that's a very passionate Sharky supporter. You're not as common as some, but, like, good on you. Um, you definitely need to be dedicated, because I'm not that keen on them myself, either, Legend. I just don't feel anything towards them. It's, like, not a hate, but it's, like, I just don't feel that anything special. Like, if I'm being straight up with you. Overrated. Mm. Uh, Dean Love stuff says, why did you eat the Rabbitohs? I ate the Rabbitohs because they were looking at me funny. He looked at me funny, legend. He got what he needed. He got what he deserved, unfortunately. <laughs> Had to be done. Had to be done, man. Had to be finished off. Hubble, Hubble, Hubble. Mate, if we were... If we were overrated, bro. Dean Love stuff. Dean Love stuff, you silly duffer. If we were overrated, we would have lost, um, we, we wouldn't have been tipped to lose against Tigers. You guys wouldn't be tipping us to lose against Tigers if we were overrated, Legend. Everyone would be tipping Parramatta to win if we were overrated. That's the thing, Legend. The fact that everyone's tipping Tigers, actually, yeah. Rabbit is very yummy. Rabbit meat kill some of the first, you can, mate, it's great. It's great, mate. Love some rabbit meat. Hey, I'll eat the eels. Bro, don't eat the eels, mate. It won't taste great. Rabbit tastes better. I, 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 I implore you, bro. I, I want you. Try and find a chocolate eel. A chocolate parabata eel. Find a chocolate parabata eel, Legend. Try your best. You won't find one, man. You won't find one. We just aren't the animals for us, bro. It's just not meant to be for us. We're just not meant to have it. We're just not meant to get it. It's just not allowed to be ours, mate. That means it's very tough if you eat enough of it without eating anything else. you got to eat other things. But, hey, you know, when you're in the middle of nowhere, you know, sometimes you got to do what you can to survive. And I'm in the middle of streaming, so I did what I could to survive, and I had the rabbit, and it was good. It was good. The rabbit was good, legends. I enjoyed the rabbit. The tasty, tasty, waskily wabbit of Elmer Fudd, boys. Waskily wabbit, tasting, tasty. It was so good, legends. <laughs> now, legends, I'm messing with you. I don't talk that funnily. Uh, I talk a little oddly, but I don't talk that sillyly. Uh, you know, whatever, whatever I'm trying to find with my words. Is that Madge? Is that Madge? Is that Maggie Maguire there watching? Looks so similar to him, doesn't it, Legends? If it isn't, jeez. Hold on, Silly Duffer. Now nah, we're both Silly Duffers, bro. Silly Duffers unite. Okay, Legends, time to say goodbye to the halftime show, Legends. The teams are ready to run out onto the field here. It is time for the second half of 40 here at 18 all. Only one victor can be named unless, of course, we somehow get a draw. So there we have it, guys. 69 votes on the poll. 51% going Sharks. 36% going Raiders. 6% saying draw. And the ref slash bunk is at 7%, guys. Oh, never mind. 70 votes, actually. Sorry, little old me making a mistake. Right, Legends? My little old silly mistake there. All right. The milk or the shark. Water versus milk. Somebody will be reigning supreme. Both are very healthy for you, water and milk. Well, depending on which pit, which um, kind of milk you get, I guess. But um, in general, healthier than a soft drink or something. The Sharkies. They are in their home territory, which could give them advantage in this one. But we're still in and off. 
Gee, spewing, man. Spewing. He's absolutely spewing for them. The Canberra Raiders legends. And we are underway here in the second half, legends. Sharks and Raiders. Here they come. Cronulla Sharp, he's rushing into the line here. Cameron McInnes held off. Now over to Sioni Katoa. Sioni Katoa held down over, though. Steve Ro Roach and Warren Smith would be your commentators if you were watching on KO Foxtel. If you're not watching the game and you're just listening to my stream, then you're listening to TJC Sports, guys. The home of Parramatta support and the NRL in general. Eels is a very popular food in China. Yeah, bro, but they better not touch my eel, bro, in um, Australia. They better not touch it here, mate. Let's go Raiders to Mel. Come on, let's go. Get it done for Mel, Raiders. Cronulla Sharks get themselves to the 40-meter line where Nico Heinz manages to take the kick. High kick there. And it manages to be collected by Jordy Ruppiner. Jordy Ruppiner now with the sidestep. Blake Braley now keeping him back here with help from Kapusi and the rest. Now, now Fogarty. Fogarty back over. Gets it to Xavier Savage. Where Savage savagely gets held down. Are you going to the game tomorrow? I've said it a few times, but obviously you you wouldn't have heard, Legend. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. And I said, yes, I'm going to the game tomorrow, Legend. I vlog every single Parramatta Eels home game. And I also uh, vlog majority of away games. I will be missing the games that are in Queensland this year, uh, Legend. So I'll be going to most games this year. That's Parramatta. And it's Legend. I appreciate you asking. Shows a bit of care there. Make sure you have a look out for the vlog, okay? Because I'm very keen for it to be able to finally film it and get it out here to you. And, oh, far kick there. And the Cronulla Sharks managed to connect. Now, Ronaldo Mulatalo, guys. He won't be shouting Sue there as he gets tackled. Zach Hosking there, rushing in. Hosking will be disappointed with last week where he didn't get enough game time, in my opinion, with Elliot Whitehead back. Maybe Ricky's learnt his lesson and will continue to give Hosking more game time. But with the side, when it has Elliot Whitehead, he obviously doesn't get the shot he really could. Ricky Stewart, watching from the box. Raiders holding him out here. Half an hour. Six again, Rock infringement. Cronulla Sharks. Six again, Rock infringement, legends. Here they come, guys. Blake Braley now looking both ways. He had a ripper of a first 40 minutes. Then to Cameron McInnes. Cameron McInnes down the line here. McInnes. Cameron McInnes with the flip and the slip and the tap and the sniffies takes him out. Lock on lock. Nico Hines. Speaking of lock in, lock -o. Nico Hines locks on here. Locko down to the 30. Halfway through the set. I think we could be a try. A try could be coming up. Six again. Rock infringement. The Granola Shark. He's on momentum now. Go, 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 go. Defend, defend, defend Raiders. Attack, attack Sharkies. Granola Sharks now. Talakai. He was responsible for a knock on at the end of the first half. Now he's going in. Now he's held. Second jackal out of the way of their six again. Then over to the left here. There we go. Cameron McInnes. Cameron McInnes with the push and the shove. Cameron McInnes. Morgan Smith. He's the savior there. Almost the day ruined for them. Then what a game we are having. And wait. Zach Hosking is down, legends. Zach Hosking will not be getting up. Zach Hosking. They're feeling his head here. Let's see what happened in his tackle. Yep. Hip hit from McInnes on his head. Unfortunately, though, there's not much he can do. Zach Hosking went for the tackle and went low. McInnes is just a tough bloke. It's an unfortunate one, but nothing illegal in that. They're just going to take a look. Worst case scenario, Zach Hosking has to go off. But uh, uh, McInnes did nothing wrong there, legends. Okay, the referee. I, I know that a, a care needs to be with the knees, guys, but I, do, I don't really see much wrong with that one myself. Two tries, two try assists in 2024. Zach Hosking has had a crazy start so far to life in Canberra. We're waiting. We're just taking a look. We're making sure he's all right. This is always a good part of the modern game. You can criticize the modern game for many things, legends. But looking after um, our players when their head injury is there is not one of them. Um, Will says... What a good game. It's turning me into Raiders. Looks like they were going to, to rough the shot. Mate, they looks like they were going to rough them up, but no, that's not what's happened. It's turning into an 18 all really close affair. Do you like Tigers? Of course I like Tigers, man. Dragons Tigers stream. I was all over the West Tigers. Was a big fan of them. All right, yeah. They're keeping the back of his head 
pressure on it from the towel. They're taking him off the field. Yeah, he's got to go off just to... Yeah, I don't know if we'll be seeing Zach Hosking back today, to be honest, Legends, with that one. But clap him off. Bravo, Zach Hosking. Going off for a head assessment injury. Dylan Br Let's go, bro. Man, let's go. I'm indifferent about eels. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, says Will. Mate, mate you're, just a, you're just a little indifferent, man. You don't really care. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't, uh, matter. Parramatta now six again. Oh, come on. Dylan Brown's injured. Where'd you hear that, Edder? That's an NBA. Where'd you hear that? Who said that? Who said that, mate? Channel 9 or? Oh, April Fools. Mate, it's not April Fools. We're not in April yet, are we? No, we're not in April yet, Legend. It's a little early for that. <laughs> a little early for that, bro. Isn't it? March? It's a little early for the April Fool's joke. Who did you go for Go for before Legend? No, I always went for Para Legend. Yeah, Fool's is tomorrow, Legend. Fool's is tomorrow. I was confused. Okay, guys. Yeah, feel free to discuss in the chat. You supported all that. It's always a fun time getting to know my Legends in the chat. Penalty here for the Canberra Raiders. The Sharkies throw their hats out of the ring going, no, no, no. We're going to hold down the ground. Held down there, guys. The Cronulla Sharks muck it up in the defense. And finally, here come the Raiders. Whoever scores first in this second half could be a massive decider at all. Bro, what's right? He ain't coming back. He ain't coming back, mate. He ain't coming back. He ain't coming back, mate. Now back over Corey Horsborough, the redhead ragger, guys. The red hanger. The red head ragger. Push it over Morgan Smithies. Smithies there to Pasami Solo. TNC was lost for words. I was, Will. I was like, there ain't no way, right? There ain't no way he's out. And then Corey Horsborough to Ethan Strange now. 10 meter line here. I was in shock, man. I was having a panic attack as an Eels fan for tomorrow when I heard him say Dylan Brown was out. <laughs> Then Levi to Solo. Back to Levi. Ping pong. Get it back. Now over to the right. Here we go. Held down Mariotta. Then Levi gets it over to Jamal Fogarty. Fogarty kicks high here. And Nico Hines collects. And he's forced into the end goal. It's a goal line dropout, legends. Cronulla Sharks. There you have it. Mel says she likes Tigers. But not when they play the Wires or the Eels. Ha <laughs> ha, Mel, I hear that legend. High five. Yeah. Yeah, nah, and I'll tell you, mate, it's, mate. I, uh, I'm not falling for it. Okay, now Nico Hines here. The Easter Bunny ears on the field. Brilliant. Hines now to take the kick here. And it's going to go to around the 40 on the goal line dropout, where Pasabi Solo collects. Solo carrying that a little lightly there. Smashed by the Sharkies. The Sharkies coming in to play rough, guys. Back Horsborough. I'll still never forget the day Horsborough put the middle finger up at the para fans. <laughs> I'll be back in a minute. All good, Dean Love stuff. Do your thing, Legend. This is just a, you know, YouTube channels are entertainment, bro. Get back when you can. Zach Hosking has failed the head assessment injury, as I expected. Told you, Legend. He will not be back today. Felt pretty clear when you saw her. It made perfect sense. Back to Smoko. Back to Smoko. Back to Smoko. He's trying to find any way to break through there. Finucane is injured as Pelican Knife. Such a shame too, because because uh, Del Finucane's a great player to have. But um, I think they made the right decision with Cameron McInnes as the general starter at lock this year with with Finucane off the bench. Usually, obviously, they're better when Finucane is also in the team, probably on the interchange, but. Yeah, he's out, bro. We don't have him for today, but that doesn't mean that they can't do a solid job done the less. We obviously had a little bit of an issue at the start of the stream with a, well, not the start of the stream, but uh, towards the halfway point, I'd like to say, of the first half where we had a little bit of power surge. Not, re not really sure why that happened, but um, haven't had much of an issue since then, and we've just been rolling out the, the party, been rocking. Because you can't stop the party, can you, Legends? Can't stop the feeling, 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 duh, duh, feeling, feeling. Speaking of feeling, the Sharks can't be feeling great as they get a penalty. 
and they end up on over the halfway line, it looks like. Man, do we, mama, how beautiful is that? Okay, guys, now Jesse Ramian will get, we'll get to play the ball again. Random ball chucked onto the field. They're going to get it out there. Boo, stop chucking random balls onto the field, Legends. What's with that? Ridiculous. March balls. Mate, March balls ain't a thing. I ain't, sticking, I ain't going up for any March balls, bro. Not putting up with that. Teach us it. Will, when would I never not be lost for words, man? Okay, Cronulla Sharks held. Second tackle. Nico Hines. If the Sharks can just get it here, Kafusi, the Sharky fans, cross your fingers, legends. And Raiders fans, you cross your fingers too, but for different reasons in the defense here. And oh, the Raiders prayers have been answered. The Sharks have messed it up. The Cronulla Sharks have dropped it. Jordan Rapida rushing in and forcing an error. On the number 17 for the Cronulla Sharkies. Beautiful, wonderful, exceptional. Let's -a go. Let's -a do it. Jordan Rapida, you are number one, baby. For Nukin's injury being noticed around. 73 votes now. TGC Kelber is out. Nah, Kelber's filling in for Bryce Cartwright because Cardi Party's out, mate. You can't trick me with that one. Okay, now the Canberra rate is 75% completion rate to the 76% completion rate for the Cronulla Sharks. How close this game has been compared to how it started is ridiculous to me. Brilliant moves from both teams. The Sharkies obviously the better side ever since that first 20 minutes. But um, the Canberra Raiders, the fact that they've managed to maintain it at 18 all and not lost, um, you know, they haven't been behind yet. So, hasn't been a loss for them yet. Okay, the fact that they haven't been behind is what I'd call a victory if I was them. Okay, Legends. Now Daddy Levi gets it short to Hudson Young. Hudson Young manages to head first bolt into it. Then Daddy Levi rushing through here, getting it short 30 metres away from the defensive line of the Cronulla Sharks. They're on 57 metres gain, fifth tackle. Jamal Fogarty's just going to have to kick it high here and clear it. And Renato Mulatalo, with very little pressures, going to manage to get that in his hands. Now forward, held down. Okay, Dean loves stuff. You're legend, bro. You're back. Well, welcome back, mate. Great to have you here, bro, once again. The emojis going crazy. Whoever loves spamming the emojis, you know what? I ain't complaining. Good for you, legends, that you love spamming those things. They, they're they a little bit of a fun entertainment for me while I'm streaming. Ooh, look at them. Cool heart, 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 face, 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 hundreds, all that stuff. <laughs> all right. Now, Cronulla Sharks. Blake Braley, two more tackles left in the set. I don't think we're going to see much from this play here, guys. If the Cronulla Sharks are going to do something this half, it's not going to be this one. Blake Braley then. Oh, they find the offload. They find the offload, but they give the Raiders time to get back on side, and I think they're just going to take the tackle. And now it's going to be a clearance here from them. Blake Braley over to the right. And now Nico Hyde with the kick of the boot. And Jordan Rapida. He looks so nervous on the ball. The high ball or the low ball. It feels like Jordan Rapida for a fullback is very much overthinking the catch, Legends. And that's the last thing you want to do. And that's where I think he's gone wrong. You know, guys, that's where I think Jordan Rapida goes wrong at fullback. I think he overthinks it at times, Legends. Despite the fact that he can do it, he overdoes it. He goes in his head. Where's it going to go? Do I catch it? Am I going to catch it? Stressing the heck out. All right, now back over. Jamal Fogarty gets it over to Schiller. Schiller scored the first try today, and what a try it was. A run down on fifth tackle. They never saw it coming, the Cronulla Sharkies, and it's helped them here to keep them all square. Joseph Tarpany then for the fifth here. Again, just another clearance. High pressure back and forth. What's happening is they get to the halfway line. And then they just kick it. Fogarty. Oh, my goodness. If the bounce went in their favor a little more, it could have been better. Jamal Fogarty's kicking game has been something else today for him. Great work, legends. So, far, 3.55K has officially been reached today. Hey, what legend you guys are. Appreciate it, people. I'm loving the milestone. I'm loving the little, little, like, bits we're going up to update the sub count every single time, legends. It really is appreciated. Now, Rabian. Down the middle. Nico Hines then gets it to the left where it goes to Sioni Katoa. Sioni Katoa, you know, he's obviously, he's a great winger, but he's just that other winger because we all talk about Mulatalo. Mulatalo is the special man, in my opinion. The special one 
You know, have you ever heard of the term, the special one? That's exactly what he is. As a soccer fan, or football fan, I should say, um, Joe, I know that from the uh, whole coach, Jose Moreno. I look him up, very successful in that sport there. Jose Moreno, he's the special one. He's special one, bruh. Special one. Speaking of special ones, that play was not very special there. It was not a special one. The camera faders, guys, they will get the ball back. Right. Oh, what a kick from Canela Sharks, though, honestly. Nico Hines, he's going, man, what did I do, bro? What did I do? This is mad here. Um, come on, Sharkies, says Aussie Bloke Craig. Come on. Come on, Sharkies. Get it done for him. Come on, the Cronulla Sharkies here, legends. Canberra Raiders, Savage. Now back over to Jordan Rapida. Jordan Rapida, arms out, head first into the line. Blake Braley holding him back. Braley, not as good of a second half as his first half, but I'm definitely noticing him still. Maybe he's just taking the moment to switch on because I'm seeing him a little more now in the defense. Sage jo so, Let's go. Aussie Blake Craig says, Sage Joe says, Hi, Tyler. Remember me? I'm Mel's niece. Of course I remember you, Sage. Mel's niece. Of course I remember you. How are you doing? All right. I hope you're doing as well as, your, um, as, as Mel because you know what, Legends? That's what I love to hear. Hello. I, I believe you guys said you watch on the telly sometimes, so hello wherever you're watching me from, Sage. <laughs> wherever you're watching me from, I'm somewhere. I'm on this. Whatever this is that I'm in right now, I'm in it, and I'm just, I'm reacting. I'm enjoying myself. I don't know what I'm stuck in on your screen, but I'm stuck in something. Hi. <laughs> and oh, no. Oh, my goodness me. Will Kennedy, guys, knocking the ball on. Voldemort letting the lack of hair equal a lack of brain cells. You're kidding me. And now the Canberra Raiders from right in front get an opportunity. Here they come. Let's go Raiders, says Mel. Let's go. Sage, are you going for the Raiders just like Mel in this one? Or are you just uh, or are you just here going, yeah, rugby league. I don't blame you either way. And then Tomoko. And oh, it goes out of play here from the Cronulla Sharks. Will says, everyone underestimated Raiders minus Weissam. If they win today, they'll be top of the ladder. Mate, yeah, we, we all underestimate them, Legend. I fully admit that and feel sorry about it. I'm sorry. Okay, Legend. Then, oh! Well, here you have it, Legends. Raiders with a full set again from in front. Madness ensues here. We all underestimated the Raiders to a ridiculous amount, and I do owe the Raiders an apology for what I expected from them this season, but come on, man, come on. Who would have thought it? I'm with you, Zempai Faders, but jeez, who would have expected the Raiders to come back how they have this season? They've been a lot better than I think many thought. And oh, no! The commentator's curse! No! The commentator's curse is real, Legends! Corey Horsburgh messes it up. The Red Head Ringer knocks it on. Oh, my gosh. Ricky Stewart taking a big sip of water there out of frustration. Oh, something tells me he'll need a little more than water after a play like that. Terrible. And now the Sharks get a feed. Yep, the Raider says Sage. Oh, brilliant to hear Sage. Hopefully they get one up for you. I may have tipped the Sharkies, but I hope that, I hope they can do it. Aussie Blake Craig says, Top teams have taken a few weeks to get back into the groove. Top of the ladder this early means nothing. Exactly, Aussie Blake Craig. Absolutely, it means nothing right now. But it's still impressive that the Raiders have started better, God, dude. Leo Francis Rogers says, What a terrible game. Um, look, man. I, myself, wouldn't say this game's been terrible. I mean, shitty. You know, like, I would say it's been an alright um, game. But, like... It hasn't been exactly the best in terms of the completion, all right? Like, what's been entertaining is watching the chaoticness of the game, how chaotic it is, back and forth, ridiculous. Um, the completion rate and the overall footy itself is terrible, bro. I'm with you all the way on that. I'm just enjoying the... Um, I'm just enjoying how funny it is, the amount of knock-ons we're seeing. There's way too many, man. Way too many knock-ons for any rugby league game. Canberra Raiders, Sebastian Chris will take the hit here. 22 minutes to go in the game, Legends. Ethan, Ethan Strange with the dummy here. Ethan Strange now flipped over and stopped there in his uh, tracks. 
Then the Canberra Raiders push it. Solo. And oh, the ball comes free. Sharks collect. Could you imagine if a game like this went to Golden Point with so many errors? Imagine if we just got so many that there was just no winner and it went to that point. No way, legends. No siree. Cannot accept it. Blake Braley back over to Hazleton to Trindle. Now, Iroh. Iroh pushes one, push, pushes two. Pushes three. Ah, oh, he almost got Tom Starling out of the way, but Tom Starling's a little bloke, mate. Should be working in Santa's workshop with kicks like that. Blake Braley appealing here. Now to the right. Over they go. Short one. Hey, fiddle. Goes. McKinnis. Down the diddle. Chittle. Tittle. 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 For little. For little. For little. For little, guys. The number 15. And now Braley, short over to Trendle. Trendle to Iro. KL Iro. And he gets a try for the Sharkies. There you have it. The Cronulla Sharks. They were 18 now down. And now they lead 22 18. The comeback. It's happened. It's happened. It happened. Unbelievable. Trindle with the beautiful pass. And he just had to stroll on through. The Raiders could not get him. It certainly required some team effort. But they will not be complaining with that one. The Sharkies have made sure that the Raiders blow their lead. 18-22. Shark Park. The Sharkies have said, you come to my house and you can beat me? Ha <laughs> ha! I'll show you. And does that. Brilliant! Rugby League at its absolutely. It may have been a bit of an up and down spiral of a game with so many errors and knock ons, but Iro will not be complaining with that one. He'll take it. He'll celebrate it and enjoy it. About time the comeback happening. Now I just need Parramatta to win tomorrow. Well, Legend, there's still time for the uh, Canberra Raiders, the Canberra Faders, you know, but you're right. About time the Cronulla Sharks completed this big comeback. 22 to 18. And Nico Hines has got the kick. 24 to 18, Legends. What has happened, Rugby League? What has happened is that the Sharkies have decided they're going to do one of the best comebacks ever. But they would not have done that comeback, York, if it was against the Panthers or something. Let's face it. It's because it's the Raiders. It's purely because it's Raiders and Sharks. If they played other teams, I don't think they could do it with their error rate, guys. They made too many errors. In fact, I, I'm convinced they get smacked by a lot of teams at the top if they do that. I think Parramatta does something on them even if they um, do that many errors against them. It was terrible, Legends. But the point is, is that they're playing the Raiders and, you know, I guess you can afford to have these kind of games against each other if it means that you can still do, that you can still get the job done. Raiders chokes. Oh, mate, this is a choke. 18-0 to 24-18, to 18, absolutely. I mean, I don't like trying to be harsh on teams, but choke, choke, absolutely. Biggest choke around. I call this a pretty good for last stream of the round, guys, for me. Because, of course, I must remind you all, I am going to the Parramatta Eels and Tigers game, so unfortunately that will not be live streamed on the channel. Now Teague Wilton. Teague Wilton now over back to Blake Bradley. Cameron McInnes, the good short pass there. Cameron McInnes gets them over halfway. And on the fifth tackle, they're going to have to clear it here. Now, kicking it far over to the right edge there. Jordan Rappiner is waiting. He doesn't overthink it. He just takes it. And now he gets tackled here by Nico Hines. Nicholas Hines, legends. He was fullback for the Storm. Halfback for Sharkies. Many questioned, which is kind of funny, how he would do at halfback when he first joined the Sharkies. But... I always knew he'd do an all right job there, and he just proved it with how he's done with them ever since joining. He's never looked back. In fact, he's always, he's always, now now he's just a halfback from through. Many, few teams will put him at fullback, unless, of course, they just have that star halfback. But, you know, Nico will always be a Sharky. I think the Sharky's the kind of team where he'll be worshipped, unlike other clubs. Now Tom Starling gets it back to Mariota, and Mariota gets flipping, the flipping the scripts legends. Then Tom Starling back over to Jamal Fogarty. Jamal Fogarty here 
Jamal Fogarty backwards. Jamal Fogarty stops. Sage, Jay, Sage at Joe says, boo, boo. You heard Sage, boo. <laughs> you heard her, boo, legends. I'm back. Welcome back, NRL. That's an NBA at its bro. Canberra Raiders. Jamal Fogarty, he looked for the pass. He looked to do something, and he just takes the tackle. Now the Cronulla Sharks get the ball. Ah, oh, it's just like back and back. If the Sharks score the next one, they've won, guys, with how this game's gone, all right? Wait, the next try, next try, guys, decides. For me, this this even does two things. Even one, there's three results in this. A team wins by one point after the Raiders score next. The Sharkies score next and win. Or we go to golden point. Those are the only three results for me. I don't see the Canberra Raiders scoring a couple and running with it. That result ain't happening to me. McKinnis. To Hines, over to Wilton, fifth tackle now, Nico Hines surveying the area, but I don't know if they're going to use him, yes they are, Nico Hines to Will Kennedy, and Ronaldo Molotalo, he chooses, he chooses option win for the Sharkies, Ronaldo Molotalo with the double, has done it, happy Easter, so, the Sharks now have their own 10 point lead, soon to be 12 points. And the Raiders have truly dropped the milk. They've spilt it all over the table. And the Sharks have swam over through the embers, guys. Through the water, through the torrential tides, onto the table to drink up that milk and bite the Raiders out of the competition. Oh, mate, that's not my decision to make, bro. And uh, that's not my decision to make, bro. Oh, man, that's not my decision to make. Um, you know, I can say something, but like, bro, it's not my decision to make. If you did something to get banned, then there's nothing I can really do with somebody else's stream. Just don't do something to get banned on my stream when we're cool, bro. But there you have it. 28 to 18 legends. The Cronulla Sharkies just flowing with it. 10 point lead. Nico Hines has not missed a kick tonight. So I reckon it's going to be 30 in a second if he keeps it up. Is his record going to be ended here though? Ready guys. Nico Hines from right in front. Nicholas with the golden feet. They're looking rather white there. Nicholas Hines, he has the golden kick. If you try to question him. He'll smash you in the feet. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Keep dreaming if you think he's going to miss a kick. Nico Hines, ladies and gentlemen. It is 30. 30, 18. 30 to 18. Oh, yeah, baby. 18, Daryl Dale, baby, oh yeah, 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 81 votes got so far on the poll, legends, you're doing a ripper of a job in today's live stream reactions, ain't you boys and girls, Mulatala will be proud of himself there with his double, brilliant work on him, now the Cronulla Sharkies, legends, through the line here, Raiders choked. Absolutely, they choked, York. Absolutely. One of the worst chokes. That is the choke of the round. I do not care. That is worse than the 14 nil. That is terrible. 18 nil choke. How do you even how do you even do that? How do you even choke 18 nil and and now concede 30 to 18? Uh, this is why you don't make assumptions, guys. It was Raiders, 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 and then Sharks proceed to score five tries. The Sharkies completely exposed the defense of the Canberra Raiders today, guys. That's where they went wrong. The attack for the Raiders, not necessarily the problem. It's that defense and the completion rate. The errors from them have been terrible, guys. That's another thing that has cost them. Far kick here over down to the left, and Jordan Rappiner collects. Jordan Rappiner now taking it. Held down. Back over, Xavier Savage. Xavier Savage now with the tap and go. Hazelton holding him out. McKinnis now telling them where to go. The captain there showing his leadership for the Cronulla Sharkies. Unfortunately, his leadership not enough to do it much in this game here. The Sharkies have taken a bite and done their comeback. He's got a Perican win next week. Mate, look, 
Look, look, look, look. It does show Parra can win next week, but I don't want to take them for granted, guys. I'm still going to go 1-12, to 12, I reckon, when I predict Parra versus Raiders. I'm not going to take this team for granted, okay? If they er do errors like this, Parra for an plus, but no. That's not how this season goes. They're going to do well against Raiders. That watch Raiders do well against Parra with how um, it tends to go with us. Long high kick there from the Canberra Raiders. They need Will Kennedy to make an error here. And Will Kennedy does it. He, mess he manages to collect. And not only does he manage to collect, he manages to win a penalty uh, despite the Canberra Raiders' protests. Pushing the defender. The Sharkies, everything going their way right now. Para two games have, have two games one week, bro. Right together, legend. Well, a lot of people have games like that, legends. Sunday, and then we have one in the yeah. Uh, you know, Para aren't the first team for that to happen to Edera um, Anthony and Ben Edits, but we get, we tr we stroll, we trot, we keep going, and we'll um we'll win, bro. Okay, I'm back in the team. We'll win, we'll win. Don't even question that, legends. We're winning. We're winning. We're winning. We're winning. Digging, digging. We ain't big stop today. Uh, you can't start me now. Cronulla Sharks. They get to the halfway. Halfway through their set now. Then over to the left here. We've got Nico Hines in support. Nicholas Hines now can get them to the 30. Braden, Braden's just looking the ways to go. You know, J Braley, guys. Blake Braley here. Braden. Who's Braden? Blake Braley, guys. Braley with the Fraley kind of pass. Cronulla Sharks now. Now they kick it high here. Ronaldo Molitano for the hat trick. Oh, back to Nico Hines. Nico Hines for the Sharks. Nico Hines for the Sharks. They're calling it. The Sharks are happy, but the referee is not happy with that one. It's, it's man versus ref. Word versus sight. Which one is correct? The bunker will have the final say in that. It wasn't knocked on into anyone. Backwards. And Nick Hines grounds it. Nick Hines grounds it. The question is, does it come? Actually, no. I call backwards too early there. we got to see where it comes from. I don't think it comes off the Raiders. I think it comes off the Sharks. I think it comes off the Sharks, Legends. I think I think it comes off the Sharkies. The Shark and Rudinis. The Shaki Roos, guys. The Shaki Roos. The Shaki Roo Roo Roos, guys. Delivering decision. It probably won't be a try, but still. And yet, there you have it. No try, Legends. No matter what special tactics we wanted to see, Nico Hines will not be banging a try against the Canberra Raiders just yet. He may have gotten the kick, but he couldn't get the try. Vid ref does it, bro. Video ref. You know what? I get the video ref there. I get him. What has happened to the ref? Video refs robbed them. <laughs> For me, I wouldn't have minded it being a try, to be honest. But you know what? I guess it keeps it a little bit more graceful of a loss for the Canberra Raiders, right? Like, at least we can give the faders that much. Now, Smithies. Morgan Smithies through the line. No try! No try, Sage Joe. No try! No try for him, legend. No try for you. Blake Braley now. Josh Papaliti. And now Daddy Levi. Wax it in the air. Whap, whap, bang, track, shakalak. Bull shakalak. It ends up with Will Kennedy. Will Kennedy now. Mate, does he even have ankles anymore, Mr. Lord Baltimore? I don't know if he does. Then Mulatalo. Renato Mulatalo was looking for a hat trick with that one, but he didn't find it. I'd say Mulatalo with actual hair, mate. He needs to shave it like he always does. It just, it's not right, mate. Mulatalo with hair, bro? Nah. I like it when he shaved. Mate, it makes sense when he shaved it down to the, you know, brim bit. It just, yeah. All right, on the halfway line here, Blake Braley, guys. Nico Hines going, sir. Will Kennedy now. Will Kennedy with the good push there. Over, and now we have the fifth tackle coming up here. Blake Braley, man. And now Trindle absolutely whacks that ball high in the air for Mulatalo. Oi, take it out. Take it out. No, they're going to say error from the Raiders. And the number 14 for the Sharks. They have just been given a try. I would take a look at that. I think he was taken off, off, out, off the ball, the Canberra Raider. 
but they will review it. We could have a try for the Cronulla Sharks again in this game, guys. Who is the number 14? It is none other than Daniel Atkinson, guys. For me, the Raider was taken out in my initial viewing of that play. I immediately thought I saw it. Ronaldo Bolotalo slamming. Look, off the ball. Off the ball. Tackles him. His eye is on the player, too. There's no argument that he's chasing the ball. His eyes are all... For me, his eyes are on the player here as he slams in. Yes, he ducks and he tackles into him. He takes him out. What are we playing, guys? American football rules? There ain't no way that you can give that. Yeah, no try, Legends, coming up here. It 100% is a tackle without the ball, Legends. And now the Cronulla Sharks, unfortunately for them, will not have that try. They still should have the win. But a try there? No. That's two disallowed tries in a row for the Cronulla Sharks. Jonathan Manson in the chat says, Hyde's incredible today. Five conversions, perfect. Oh, Hyde's has been beautiful, bro. 100%, mate. Nico Hyde's doing exactly what I said, bro. People go, oh, Nico Hyde's ain't that great of a halfback. Get out of here. He's a great halfback, legends. Great halfback. There was a time he was better than Moses, bro. He was brilliant, bro. Nico Hyde's potential is unbelievable. 45% possession for Raiders. You can really tell it with how the game's gone so far. 30, tackle, 30 times tackled in the opposition half for the Sharkies. And the Raiders just le less, bro. So much less. I'm sure you're very happy, Jonathan Manson, as a Sharky supporter. I can't blame you. Good for you, legend. Really happy that they could do it for you. Tom Starling now. Six again, Ruck infringement. Remember, guys, last try wins. Last try wins. Hudson Young. That's how the Raiders are playing. Last try will win it. Morgan Smithies. Morgan Smithies looks through the line for anything that he can find and gets held down. Now, Starling. To Jamal Fogarty, it's a number six again here. Josh Papali'i, Josh Papali'i now. Will Kennedy and Blake Braley holding him out there. Then Starling goes short over to Hudson Young. Hudson Young thought he could just break through the line there, but he couldn't. Starling, the star on the league, goes to Fogarty, to Rapida. And James Stiller scores on the right wing. James Stiller, legend. Refusing to go down without a fight for the Canberra Raiders. Howdy, Adderall. That's an NBA edit. Howdy, the try life, says Schiller. Brilliant. James Schiller. Schiller culling the competition. The Sharkies could not catch him. 22-30. It is far from a disgrace. The Raiders choose. The Raiders, guys. Refusing not to fight till the end. 30-22. Could be 24-30 in a sec. Eight minutes to... Oh, eight minutes to go. Game on. Eight minutes to go. Game on, baby. Try. That is his third career double, Legends. Let's go. Game on. Game on with seven and a half minutes to go. It's happening. Rugby League, we are not done yet. Sharks Raiders, you are still very much in the relevance of topic. Come on. Go Shark, he says Aussie boy. Nice one, James, says Sage Joe. Nice one, James Schiller. Sage was very impressed with that. And he's... Oh, no. He missed it. He missed it. Oh, no. He missed it, Legends. He missed it. He hit the post. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hitting the post. That's the last thing he needed in that, guys. Oh. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Yeah, no. Nah, they can't. Unless they score... In the next two minutes, I don't see it. Oh, my God. I don't see it unless it's in the next two minutes. Oh, we really needed to get that kick, Legends. Come on, the green machine, says Mel. Could the incredible comeback be on, guys? The Raiders need a penalty and some kind of great run, Legends. That's what they need. Josh Papali'i into the line. Josh Papali'i. 
Papa Lee he now slams there by the Sharks. The Sharkies will just look to defend, I think. Defense is what will win Sharks the game now. No silly runs, no silly off your line run, like passes. No, nothing stupid. Keep yourself on side, keep yourself going. Tom Starling now, beautiful pass to him. Okay, they're going to want to screw it like the next, like, I swear, like two minutes if they want even the smallest fraction of a hope. Smithy's now. Morgan Smithy's in there. Come on, boys. You know, you don't ever ride a team off until the very wh whistle blows. But, oh, who's the para verse tomorrow? We versus the Tigers, Sage Joe. We versus the West Tigers. I'm hoping that we can get the victory for us, um, Sage. I'm crossing my fingers about it. And the Raiders, they kick high here. Legends, and... Oh, it's allowed to bounce! And no, it bounces out of play. It bounces out of play. Sharkies will look to just run with it. Are you kidding me? Tom Starling, they tried, but it just wasn't enough in this game just yet. Look, I can't fault the Raiders for effort, but this is a choke. They should have won. They should have won at 18-0, and they've absolutely given it to the Sharkies. They switched it off mentally, it feels. They just haven't been the same ever since they had that 18-0 lead. It's been a complete fall off from them. And while you want to find the positives, you just got to be honest, guys. Blake Braley over to Sioni Katoa. Sioni Katoa now, Legends, on the first tackle. Passing it off here. Go, go, go. Move it, move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. He like to move it. I like to move it, move it. Yeah, Legends, let's go. Now, Blake Braley. Back to Trindle. Good pass. Come on, here they go. Bye, Raiders. Bye, 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 the Canberra Raiders. Bro, the chances. They had the opportunity to even come back. Like, this game, despite all the errors, has been quite fun. Nico Hines! Over! This could be the winner! And oh, Teague Wilton is stopped before he could find a pass there. Go, Para NRL to the NBA, it's mate. Go. Nico Hines now. I'm ready. I'm ready, Legends. I'm ready to vlog Para tomorrow, right? My mind's going fully Parramatta once full-time hits of this game, all right? Fully it. Make sure you look out for it on Tuesday, Legends. I'm going to be working tirelessly on Monday to edit what will be the best vlog of the season, I hope, for you guys, all right? I aim to keep going and keep doing it and showing my passion for my side. Little bit of a Russell tussle there, and now the Raiders get the ball back here. Four and a half minutes to go. Jonathan Manson says sympathies. Sharks have lost so many bad plays. For example, to Roosters last year. Raiders will make top eight. They will make top eight if they play better than this legend. If they if they um, keep conceding like this, nah. I agree with you that um, have lost on many bad plays. I agree Sharks have conceded the same kind of issues in the past due lo to losing on bad plays. But I think Raiders can only blame themselves today, legend. The errors, not good enough. They, even if they make half the errors, they can see that they're still, I think they're still square or even in the lead if they can see even half the errors they've done, mate. I'm with you, though. I feel sympathy for the Canberra Raiders a little too here. But I did tip the Sharkies, and I am relieved that my tip is correct. But, of course, tips aren't the end of the world for me. I just like getting them right. Savage, back over, and Strange had the chance, and he didn't get it. Sebastian Chris now. And Sebastian Chris going, what are you on about, sir, as the knock-on happens? Oh, my goodness me, legends. My deary goodness. And thank you to the 87 people who have voted so far on the poll. The 52% of you voting for Sharkies, you have been proven correct. 36% of you that, that tips Raiders up the milk. I'm sorry, legends. You probably were quite excited at one point in this game, right? Draw. Don't care who wins is at 5%. And the ref slash bunker is at 8% legends. To the 5% of you who didn't care who wins, but still voted and still got involved in the stream, thank you. Okay? And, you know, thank you to the viewers of both others as well. It's great having a lot of people. You know, it's great having people jump onto the streams. Nico Hines. Nicholas Hines now past the 40 meter. The Raiders holding it back. Now Blake Braley. Braley over to the right here. Gets it to Teague Wilson. Teague Wilson now. Sage Joseph's three minutes. Three minutes to go, Sage. Three minutes. The game has pretty much been decided, but credits to the Cronulla Sharkies and the Canberra Raiders. They're still giving it a game. They're still giving us a fun time to watch, guys. Parabee Tigers, Sage. Okay. 
the Parramatta Eels versus the West Tigers. I'm really hoping that blog works out tomorrow for us. Honestly, I love seeing the families get into the chat and look after each other. Sweet to hear. And look at that, guys. The Canberra Raiders managed to collect. Now the Raiders down the left here. Tom Starling. Remember, maybe they can get a try here. Last try wins. Last try wins, legends. Last try wins. Last try wins. You remember that? They got it before, but they can get another last try. Another last try. Come on. Make it only a two-point difference. <laughs> Levi to Jamal Fogarty. Jamal Fogarty gets it to Jordan Rapida. Jordan Rapida now. Squeezing through the line. Fifth tackle. For me, you might as well run it. But no, they're going to kick it. They're going to kick it. And it ends up in the hands of Sione Katoa. Now Sione Katoa flipping the script. Flipping the Raiders around here. The number two. Now taking the spin and taking the tackle here. The camera Raiders holding him off now. Jamal Fogarty forcing him back. Now Nico hides over to the left where Mulatalo is. Weird effect there. Mulatalo! Ronaldo Mulatalo! Oh my goodness me! Why is no one tackling him? Mulatalo! Now to Jesse Ramian. Back to Mulatalo! Mulatalo now! Mulatalo gets them 25 metres away from the line. Ronaldo Mulatalo had an exceptional run there. The crowd has been 12,692 people at Shark Park. If you're one of those people, congratulations on your victory on your on your soil, bro. Nico Hines with the long pass. Last try wins, baby. And it is the Cronulla Sharks. We'll be taking that, that title literally. Sioni Katoa. And the Sharkies now lead 34-22. The game, unfortunately, just too much for them to handle, guys. Well, if you live in New Zealand, it'll be a different time, Mel. You could probably let, let her know when it is in New Zealand. For Australia, it's 4 p.m. For Australia, the game starts at 4, and I will be obviously there cheering my team loud and proud from the same seat as ever. Okay, right, backing my team 100% all the way. What a try, Sioni Katoa. 34-22. They're taking the last try wins, literally, Legends, and going to be winning with the last try of the game. Bravo, Sharkies. Bravo. From a terrible beginning to a brilliant end, the Raiders will be just... You can see they grew about 10 years older in this game. The Sharkies, the celebrations all around. You can thank Renato Mulatale for his incredible run earlier. Yeah, Aus yeah, exactly. Yeah, New South Wales, Australia is 4 p.m. Is it different? Is it like free something for you, Aussie bloke, Craig, in Queensland? In New South Wales, though, yeah, 4 p.m. Australia. I know there's different time zones. I just work on the fact that I've only ever lived in Victoria and New South Wales, Aussie bloke, Craig, which both have the same kind of time schedule um, thing in time zones. They're very similar legends. And Nico Hines turns around and says, Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Bravo, how do you like that? He's putting on a show for you, legends. He does not miss. And at full time here, the Cronulla Sharks have officially won 36-22. Unfortunately, 18-0 lead the Raiders once had. Becoming a bit of a blemish and a bit of something that they could end up regretting ever having had in this game. Thank you so much for watching, Legends. If you enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button. As always, subscribe. It's been an incredible round of live stream reacting here. I really do appreciate all of the viewers um, that jumped in for this one. Absolute legends. I wish nothing but the best to you. I hope you all had a happy Easter and are still enjoying your Easter. Still a bit of time left, so enjoy. Have those little chockies. Finish off everything. Appreciate the day you've had, all right? Because you're all legends. I'll see you. Um, you'll see me for the uh, vlog, Para Tigers, on the Tuesday when it comes out. And uh, when it comes to uh, when I'll see you next, I'll see you next, next week when hopefully we do some streaming. Thanks for watching, Legends. See ya next time. Whoa! Up the, up the Sharkies. Congratulations on the victory, guys. Better luck next week, Raiders. Who do you play next week, actually? 
You play, uh... Oh, yeah, you play us. I'm going to Canberra. I'm going to Canberra. How did I forget that the Raiders play us? Oh. Sorry that you're going to have to lose another week. Three games in a row, Raiders. Eels 13 plus tomorrow. Peace out, everyone. Up the Eels. Hoping we can smash the Tigers. Come on, baby. This has been an incredible stream, Legends. Happy Easter.